Well, since the question is things and not people, I think for me, I'm kind of, uh, I enjoy reading, so as long as I had a Nook or an iPad, iBooks, I, and uh, television with cable, I'm pretty much good to go. Three things to take with me on a desert island. The first two, um, first would be my iPad. I love my iPad. Um, having my apps and also my books is important to me. The second would be my digital camera, um, to link that with my iPad. And the third, although not a thing, is something I couldn't live without, and that's my family. If I were stranded on a desert island, I'd probably want to bring three things. I'd want to bring sunscreen for sure, uh, chocolate, because you know, what's better than that? And on a practical side, I'd bring a Swiss Army knife because you've got your utensils, you've got your weapon, you know, you've got a nail file, you've got a, even a toothpick. If I was stranded on a desert island, I would bring Sammy, my five-year-old Weimariner, and Gilda, my three-year-old Weimariner, and Hugh Jackman because, um, oh, right, because I hear he loves Weimariners. I think if I was stranded on a desert island, I would take family, um, a book, probably historical fiction-based book, and sunscreen so that I could transition easily into the <laughs> environment. <laughs> well, if I was stranded on a desert island, the way I would think about this is someone who always tries to find the opportunity in every situation and someone who's had a very long week, that I would love a good book, a cool breeze, and a great bottle of wine. <laughs> if I was stranded on a desert island, I would like to bring my husband, a large stack of books and magazines, and a very big vat of Diet Coke. Lots of ice. If I was stranded on a desert island, I'd really want my family to be there first and foremost. And then the practical side of me says, I probably should have a supply of matches because fire is pretty important to keep you warm as well as to use for cooking. And a coworker of mine um, told me, you need duct tape because you can make just about anything out of duct tape to help you survive. I would definitely want to bring a solar-powered satellite telephone because I wouldn't be deserted for very long. But if I couldn't have that, my husband and I always wanted and said we could always live in a cardboard box. So I would take my family, a cardboard box, and cooking utensils so I could utilize all the fresh fruits on the island and have some fun. If I were trapped on a desert island, I would want an iPad with um, uh, Wi-Fi and unlimited power source, of course. Um, I would also want my cats, and I would probably want some sunscreen, because that sounds pretty awesome right now, actually. 